Greg Shoemaker, TriStateFootball.com here with Chris Majors, the head coach of the Norwood Indians. They went 10-1 tonight as they went in the first round over the Fenwick Falcons and coach. Tenth time this season your football team has held an opponent to 17 points or fewer, and this was a GCL team. Talk about that defensive performance tonight. Uh, the opening drive, you know, it was a little nervous. They marched, they marched right down the field running the ball uh, and scored right away. But after that, our defense uh, made a couple of adjustments, but our defense uh, rose to the occasion. Uh, we were going into it, we were – undersized up front so we had to rely on our speed and athleticism and, and our kids executed what we asked them to do and, and, and rose to the occasion. You know, you were undersized up front. I don't know his name off the top of my head, but your, your nose guard, number 62 tonight, I thought he took on a lot of different guys, enabled kids like Gabe Rice to make plays in the secondary, Boston to make plays early on. Can you talk about his play? Yeah, Ronnie Williams, he's our, he's our nose. Uh, He's a big, physical, strong kid uh, that uh, garners a lot of double teams, uh, and that enables Gabe and Jonathan and DJ Britt to make some plays. plays. So tonight, when we look at some players tonight, I thought that uh, their demeanor, even though this was a big game, they stayed calm. How did you uh, tell those kids to, to, to keep that presence throughout the football game? We talk about championship, having championship poise all the time. Um, and just believe in the plan, and, and our guys believe in the plan, and, and we execute it, and, and, and good things happen when we do that. So you went to Moeller, you played there, you were an assistant there for a lot of years. Now you're here at Norwood. How's it feeling about being a part of this community and seeing them want something so bad as they did tonight to win this game? It's, it's special. It's special. From where we were last year, we finished at 2-8. and eight. To, to right now, it's just an unbelievable feeling for me and the staff to see how far our kids have come. Um, it's, it's unbelievable. And before I let you go, Andrew Conover had some great plays tonight, but Gabe Rice, your seniors, I thought they were just, when it came down to it, just their leadership was pretty awesome. Can you talk about them a little bit? Yeah, all of our, we have, we have some great seniors. We have 11 seniors, all of them start for us. Um, and they, they truly have been the difference this year. Um, they, they lead by example, and then when people are falling out of line, they lead by line. That, that truly is why we have made the strides that we've had this year. Moving forward, I mean, you're one of four teams left now in Region 16. There's some big boys left. Uh, are you guys are you going to sit on your laurels, or do you think you, you're still more left in the tank? Well, our goal is to win a state championship at this point, so there's more left in the tank, and we're going to take one day at a time. So. There you go. Chris Majors, the head coach of the Norwood Indians. They win tonight 21-14 over the Fenwick Falcons. I'm Greg Shoemaker for Tri-State Football.